Hey there, wrestling gurus. It's the one, the only, you're so right, wrestling gurus. It is what? Team Rai Rai. And I'm back in action to make another video. It is so great to be on cam. I stole that from the Miz. Hail you, Miz. But before I continue with this video, check out my latest podcast. It is called Team Rai Rai's Wrestling Podcast. Episode number six. Yes, six. We have a lot of things to discuss. So if you are bored and you, wait, if you want to work and if you just want to crank up your tablet or whatever, it's a great podcast. We did a great job. Thank you guys to come on board. Okay, now in this video, you know how I rant about the big show and Kane? Well, it would be another rant. I had a request from my good buddy, I know for a long time already, but I'm going to cut to the chase name. Tony Talent. Check his um, YouTube out. His link will be down below. That's just a cheap plug, my friend. Okay. The guy I want to discuss is Mark Henry. Okay. I'm not going to discuss his whole career because it will take forever. So I'm just going to do the best I can. Okay. He was born on June 12th, 1931. Probably most of you guys know and ladies because the internet ruins things these days. American per power lift or power lift or Olympic heavyweight strong and a professional wrestler who signed who currently signed to W. He's a two time Olympia ninety two and ninety six. So I'm just gonna skip this stuff. The good stuff I really want people wanna hear. Blah blah blah. Man, there's a lot of stuff I'm marking my holy cow. I just want to get to the good stuff. The good stuff. Okay. The WF. The early days, 96, 97, at age 24. Okay. Now he was just a Mick Carter. Um. And, you know, I don't know if they come on Mick Carter, but I'm just going to skip that. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. Nation of Domination slash Sexual Chocolate. Now, the first thing was freaking awesome. He was with The Rock and um, Farouk. That group was awesome. Now, when he was in a different character, Sexual Chocolate, not so much. I mean, it was funny in that era, but if you look, if you look back at it, it was not good. He did that sexual chocolate gimmick, 98 to 2000. I guess he did bo both nation, de nation de nomination and sexual chocolate. I, did, I guess he did it the same year. Um, what else? Oh, Valley Wrestling Strong Man Competition, 2000 and 01. So that's good for him. Okay, Brain Switch, 0204. I don't remember that. I guess I'm gonna okay. Per, proceed the World Heavy Championship 0506. Of course, he was the ECW champion. I mean, that's good for him, but that's not the original ECW. He came a long way, you know. I mean, of course, he had a, a few with the Undertaker at WrestleMania 22. A lot of people didn't like that match because, of course, Undertaker's going to win that match because he was undefeated at the time. Now, I am not a big fan of Mark Henry, but he, he did a lot of things for wrestling business or for WF slash WWE, you know? Come on. This takes forever. That's what I hate about this damn tablet. Sorry. If you guys and ladies... Or may I because I'm doing this? Hopefully, you guys have patience. Okay, from the injury, 07 08, you know, of course, you know, I don't know what happened. Maybe he's injury prone or 
A freaking accident, that sucks. Oh wait, he already got injured. Okay, here it is. Henry returned on May 11th, 07, after weeks of hyping his return. Yeah, remember that. He attacked after the world champion, the Undertaker, and blah, 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 you know, you know, you know that story. Let's see, Mark Henry returns to W program on the October 23rd episode of ECW Tech. Kane, oh god, you know. The ECW champion 08, 09, I mean, that was good for his career. I think he's the most dominant ECW champion at that era. You know, he's a big guy. Who can beat him in real life? But this is wrestling in the world. Anybody can beat his ass, you know? Especially if someone cheats, you know? The tag team um, title, 09, 011. Who's his freaking partner? Oh, MVP! Uh, um, yeah, that was not a great team. I don't think they were ever tag team champions. Paul Alpine, the world champion of 11 012. Only one run. I mean, and then the cool part is, I love that awesome promo. Um, I had a great career, I'm gonna hang it up. And then he beat the shit out of John Cena. He had a great match with John Cena. Then Super Cena beats him. The storyline is over. That sucks. You know who should win that match? Mark Henry. He's a veteran. He's a way better veteran than John Cena, I think. He's been in business longer than John Cena from my point of view, but whatever. I would discuss it with a rant before I'm done with this. Come on, some bitch. So I'm getting a little mad now. You never see Rai Rai, Team Rai Rai get a little irritated. And you don't want to see me mad, especially on camera. It's not a pretty sight. I might do something I will not regret. Okay, um. I mean. Look at this. It was great that he was free. See, just see. God damn it. F freaking um, wi Wikipedia on this damn tablet. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Sorry, I'm getting mad. But probably don't be don't give a shit if I get mad or not. Okay, he was the world champion. So you guys know that already. That was great for his career, you know. Great, awesome, spectacular. Later career, 2013. And now, now, he needs to retire, okay? He needs to hang it up. Same thing for Kane and the Big Show. The re only reason they're there, probably just for a easy paycheck, or I know he's not in a, no major storyline anymore. That's not good for him, but that's good for wrestling fans currently because we want to see the, the new up, up, upcoming story like from NXT or whatever. And he pays his ways. He needs to hang up. He needs to be in the Hall of Fame, okay? Not Hall of Fame, Hall, not Hall of Fame, Hall of Fame, okay? Personal life, I don't give a shit. No offense. He has some great matches. Um, is he a future Hall of Famer? Probably. Tony Ellis was a, is a manager. Um, Theo Wong was his manager. Molina was his manager. Really? His nickname was the World's Strongest Man. I love that. Sucker Chocolate. I don't care for that nickname. The King, the King of the Jungle. I never heard that one. The World's Strongest Champion during the ECW days. So. Okay, here it is. Just gonna skip this shit. This man, he has a lot of stuff on. Holy crap! I'm just gonna get this professional stuff. That's all. I, that's how I want to. That's why I care about. God damn. Okay, let's go W. Okay, sorry, this is a long video. Okay, the ECW champion one time, the World Heavy Title champion one time, of course. Um, the WF European champion one time 
Wow, you guys know that? He was a European champion one time. Three times slamming award. Wow. Holy shit move of the year from 2011 when uh, him and Big Show went through the ring at Adventures. They, they just copy off of Big Show and um, Brock Lesnar at that time. That's all. Um, feet of the strength of 2013. Pull two trucks with his bare hands. Slam or of the year 2014. Team Cena versus the authorities at Survivor Series. So that's about it. But overall, he came a long way, okay? He was in business from 96. He got injured back in the day. Um, he'd been, been with WWE for a long ass time. So, Mark Henry, if you're watching the video, dude, hang up your freaking boots. Or, if you're a smart wrestler, probably, you're gonna, probably a lot of my viewers are going to hate this with a passion, help out. The guys from NXT. Because eventually they're gonna take your damn spot, dude. Sorry, I break it down to you. But you're not gonna get no more title shots. I know my friend named Tony told me that there's rumors that you want one more title shot. Come on now, bro, it's not gonna happen. Not for long shot. There's young guys from NXT want to go wants to be on the main roster and headline WrestleMania. Brother? I know I stole it from Hogan, but that's just my quick thoughts on Mark Henry. That's a little rant. He needs to freaking retire. The three biggest stooges, not stooges, but the, the three biggest men in the E right now needs to retire. So I made a video on Kane. I made a video on the Big sh Slow or Big sh Show. And now, I made a video on Mark Henry. If you like it, that's great. If you don't like it, then forget about it. So this is your friend here, Rai Rai. It's going to sign off here. Everyone have a great night, and I'll see you on the flip side. All my links are down below. Now, if you're not subscribed to this damn YouTube channel, click the, the damn um, subscribe button. It's not that damn hard.